Hello everyone and welcome to It's Gonna Be A Thing. This week, writer's block party. Ain't no party like a writer's block party cause a writer's block party don't stop. At some point in time, we have all experienced the dreaded writer's block. I'm actually experiencing it right now. Uh, it's a time where you need to write or be creative and you just can't. That is why I present to you writer's block party. All you need for a writer's block party are some friends and a few activities to get the creative juices going. Pulp free, of course. Some writer's block party activities may include Pictionary. Okay, time's up. Uh, 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 it's a picture of a dictionary. Yes. Oh. Yes, 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 yes. Solve the acronym. 12 rabid otters unite tonight? You guys! Yes. What? In your face, in your face. And a personal favorite of mine, right dancing. I don't know why I didn't think of this before! Shout out to My Life After Breakfast, Captain Rio Dijon, and Jim Llama for helping out in this video. If you think writer's block party should be a thing, or have experienced writer's block yourself, leave a comment and or a video response below. So next time you creatively you've hit a wall, hold a writer's block party. It's gonna be a thing. Is this a warning? <laughs> should we be concerned about this? <laughs>